We had the ID TechX show here at Flex booth. So who are you? So my name is Sank and I'm the Vice President of Product Marketing for Flex. And what we're showing here are a couple different things. You can see one of our customer um, applications, which is the virtual reality uh, solution for enterprise applications. So this is, you can think things like warehousing and assembly and engineering. So what is it? what do you do with this? Are you manufacturing this? Yes, yes. So we help them with the manufacturing of this and also part of the hardware design. They bring together also a lot of the software application themselves and then combined it becomes a complete solution. It goes through uh, this thing. Yes, you could wear this device and if you were to put this over your head, yeah. what you would be able to see is you get a screen in front of you and it allows you to interact with the application that you have in the real world. Nice, like that. That is correct. So it's augmented reality. It's augmented. Cool. So what does Flex do? So Flex, we basically. Yeah. yeah, sorry. At Flex, we design and manufacture products and solutions across the world for our customers, yeah. and this includes everything from consumer products to energy products to automotive, medical, and even uh, networking. Some of the segments you have right here. Yeah, he, this is just showing you kind of an evolution from what we call Sketch, where you have the initial technology and concepts, and taking it all the way through the development process till you get to some of the commercial products, like what we're showing from our partners over here. And uh, so, are you manufacturing experts? Or, uh, yeah, so we are experts in both the design, the engineering, and the manufacturing of products. And uh, where do you manufacture? Uh, we're in 30 countries. So we have 19 manufacturing sites here in the U.S. itself, but also in many countries across the world in almost every continent. In China? In China as well, as well yeah. as in Europe, as well as in um, North America. And uh, what are we looking at over here? So this is one of the products from one of our customers called uh, MAS Holdings. They're showing you how they're taking um, basic garments and integrating smart electronics into it so that you can, for example, have lit systems if you're a runner or in cycling. What's in the pants? As well as, this has sensors in the pants, so this is tracking your biomechanics as you run. So you can see in here, it's integrated in there. And so as you run, it'll track the information, send it to your cell phone, give you information on your activity. That's the Lumo Run. This is Lumo Run. I saw them, uh, I think they're... Uh, they were speaking here as well. A, is it a, a Silicon Valley company? Uh, they have an office in San Francisco, and they also have. All right, cool. So that's also Luma Run. This is all. This is all Luma Run. Luma Run, right there. So how uh, successful are they with their product? So they are. They actually are having the market for a little while now, and they're getting a lot of traction because of the ease of use. And these, all these products can be easily worn and washed okay. and used. Okay, one standing up. Okay. So uh, that's uh, was crowdfunded or something like that, or no? I don't know the details. Got, I could ask yeah. uh, them on the funding okay. part. Let's go around here. Uh, we go in the back over here. So what are you doing with the shoe? So here we're showing you basically how you test the different sensors that we are developing. So this is, you can see on the right hand side, there's a little bit display of different force sensors. Yeah. Can you and those? integrated. All right. Uh, and uh, then we have right here, uh, display, is it OLED? This is just a very simple LED display that's in there, uh, but just showing you again from a standpoint of how you can integrate the technology into it, and it gives you an idea of what's possible. And uh, you have stuff for the smart yeah. materials, textiles, substrates, all of these things that are... So this is one of our companies called Wink. Wink basically does home automation as you may know, and we're showing you the integration of home automation to the automobile. So essentially, you can control everything in your device, uh, everything in your house, all your devices, whether they be lights or door locks or other applications. And now by tying it to the car, from the car itself, you can communicate and talk to your home, and vice versa, conversely, you could talk from your home to your car as well. And you can see over here, here's a wearable device. This is actually for a Jaguar Land Rover. And when you wear this, you're actually now inter interacting with the car itself. So that means uh, you, you don't need to, it opens the car, the car for you? That is correct. So for example, it now recognizes where you are by proximity. You can now open the car lock. You can communicate with the vehicle itself. And it's just a different way of changing the interface from carrying your standard keys. 
Right.